President William Ruto's admission of loneliness and the presidency during the inauguration of his new deputy, Professor Kithure Kindiki, lifts the lid on events that led to the unveiling of his running mate in 2022. The president, against the outcome of a vote by lawmakers from Mount Kenya region, chose his former deputy, Rigadi Gashagwa. Two years later, a fallout in the presidency led to the removal of Gashagwa from office by way of impeachment, which was followed by a brief court battle before the installation of Kithure Kindiki. Ayub Abdikadir has that report. From the outset, his choice was contentious. Handpicked by President William Ruto against Kithura Kindeki, bringing to the limelight a first time lawmaker whose next role was to help then Deputy President to win the race to State House. This against the desire of lawmakers who chose the professor of law instead. And a long night of vote after vote at the current residence of the Deputy President ended up in a stalemate. That good Kenyan, my friend, whom I have worked with, especially on the economic model. He understands people's issues. He is passionate about ordinary people. A living example of a true hustler who rose from the hardships of the aftermath of our freedom struggle to the pinnacle of professional business and political success. The spell of praise lengthened for Gashagua. Two days later, in Madira constituency in Nyeri County, on the pair's first political engagement in the region. I want also to assure the people of Madira, Nyeri, and the people of Kenya that Rigadi Gashagwa is a very strong personality. And I am at home. And I was looking for a very strong personality because matters Kenya require men and women who are not fickle. In the months after coming to office, the president giving an inside account of the process that birthed his running mate, making an admission of how he overlooked Professor Kindiki, his now deputy. Wakati tuliko tunapangana, pali, tukapangana, Nikaita wabunge hawa, nikawambia sasa nyinyi wabunge kwa sababu tumepangana vizuri. Mimi nataka munitafutie, munaona tutapangana na mnagani. Tuwe na deputy wako nisaidia. Hawa wabunge wakaongea, wakaongea, wakaongea. Nikaona wananielekeza kwa vijana. E, wakaniambia kijana mzuri, fulani ni mzuri, kijana fulani wabidi, kijana fulani ni wana hii. Lakini mimi niluambia apana. Waja mimi nipangane na uyurigiji. Ni kweli ya mazi kweli? Sini kweli? Kwa sababu uyurigiji ni muti ya rika yangu. So tunaweza kupangana na yeye. Eh? Ndiyo tuweze kusongesha mambo mbele. An account corroborated by some lawmakers who took part in the voting for Ruto's running mate. So we whipped each other and we did the second round of nomination. And Rigathi Gashagwa got 21 votes and Kithure Kindike got 38 votes. Mm -hmm. And we did not agree and the meet meeting was, was, was cutted and we were uh, requested to attend the next day, early morning, so that we can now conclude. Why and we did decided, you not agree? But we did the, not agree because yeah. um, the president himself wanted Rigathi Gashagwa. Sharp differences at the presidency in the following months brought to an end what was otherwise qualified as a working partnership. The president and his allies accusing Gashago of advancing a different agenda, ending with his impeachment and the swearing-in of Professor Kithura Kindiki, who assumes an office he so desired to hold under reunion with similar characterization at his inauguration, the head of state deploying the same attributes he used to characterize Gashagwa. My young brother, let me call you Abraham K or Abra K. Welcome to the service of this great nation, Kenya. You are eloquent, my brother. You are, in, you are intelligent, my brother. I am confident that you will do that which I have missed 
for the last two years. I know you will. Ayub Abdikadir, Citizen TV.